Hello everybody! In this video I will show you an interesting effect about polarity of magnets and for this I have a huge neodymium magnet. This one is 10, 10 centimeters in diameter and 1 centimeter in height. A big strong neodymium magnet. And first off let me check the polarity of it. We have south pole on this side and of course North Pole on the other side. This is just a compass. So I will lay it like this that we have South Pole on the top side. I removed it quickly and we take this interesting magnet array. These are two circular magnet arrays stacked on top of each other. I will show you how the magnets are arranged later. But first let us check the polarity. So we have South Pole on this side and North Pole on the other side. Like this. North Pole here and South Pole here. Okay. So what is interesting is we have this magnet, south pole up, and on this side we have north pole, on this side we have south pole. And normally, if you take two magnets with different polarity, they will attract. So let's just test this, place it on top here, and you will see it's attracted. It doesn't come off when I do this. And now I will take the array, flip it over to the other pole, place it on here and you will see it's also attracted. doesn't fall off. I think this is a very interesting phenomenon that only appears with this huge magnets that are large in diameter and quite thin in comparison to the diameter and with this special magnet array. And if I just take it like this, of course you can't feel what I feel and yeah, I can't really show you this on camera what I can feel, but I just will hover around it and I will tell you what I feel. So um, right around here on the outer edge I feel a strong repelling force and up around here um, also a light repelling force and if we come closer to the center it gets attracted. And this on the other polarity it is kind of the same but it gets repelled more on the... Or let's say repelled here and if I come closer it gets attracted. This is what you can see here. And on the center part gets repelled up until here about half a centimeter away and if I get completely close to it it will get attracted. And now let's put this one away. It's a dangerous magnet. Um, I will show you this array. I've showed you this in earlier videos. This is the exact same array that I use for my water memory cleaning device that has the same array built in and yeah I will first disassemble it and you see it is two magnet arrays and the way it is built is we have eight um, neodymium cube magnets five millimeter in size and they from the polarity they are all facing the same direction meaning we have south pole on the inside and all of these are south pole facing inside and of course north pole facing outside. And on this it's the opposite, we have north pole all facing inside and south pole all facing outside. And what is interesting is when you take a compass you will see we have south pole here and also on the other side we also have south pole. And of course the opposite is the case here with this one. We have North Pole here and on the same we have also North Pole here. 
if you attach them together like this we get south pole here and north pole here and I will show you what this looks like and that a magnetic viewing film get an array like this with a field like this from the top it kind of looks like the field of a normal regular magnet except for when I get closer to it you will see a bright spot at the center where there is no color meaning yeah no magnetic field and the same goes for the other side if I flip it around and here I have a side view of it also looks interesting and I just rotate it along the side yeah and this is just the top view of it so yeah I thought this is a quite interesting effect that you can actually attach a magnet array with a polarity of north and south here um, a huge neodymium magnet that is, yeah, of course has north and south pole it's axially magnetized and just for comparison um, I have a stack of regular neodymium magnets um, four of them and there are also of course north and south here and if I do the same you will see it doesn't work it, I have to hold it like this because it instantly wants to flip and yeah I don't want to get loose of them because it's very violent <laughs> because this magnet is really strong and the opposite side of course it gets attracted to it but yeah this effect doesn't work that I can attach it on both polarities like here like this and yeah this is why I think this kind of magnet array has really interesting properties that I haven't seen with other Halberg configuration or yeah other magnet arrays so that's it for this video. Thanks for watching and goodbye.